What's so up my dudes, Valk here, and today I'm going to be showing off the Raiden Shogun a little bit, showing off my build specifically because in my strongest Raiden Shogun build, a lot of people seem to not understand exactly how my Raiden Shogun was built, and I'm going to showcase what she can do, essentially, and why she's insanely strong, why I call her the strongest. So the one thing I'm going to do, you can see I have this crit rate circle. This is normally what I use because I value consistency over potential, just my personal take but i have this really really crack crit damage circle that i've had for quite a while i just don't use it because once again i value consistency but we're going to swap it on over to that and we're going to use this team here as you can see whenever i swap it over that i'm 43 175 you can see the team at sara raiden kazu and zhongli so then you're going to ask Valk, why don't you use Bennett? Um, the main reason is because I don't have him built. Same reason with my Sara, why I never use Sara. Sara is level 40 currently. She uses Elegy for the end. Uh, talent level 4 because you can't level it up. And then if, during the video, she has 4 piece of noblesse on for the attack, bus, or attack buff. So you can see that. And then we go over to Bennett. You can see Bennett is level 50. Uh, he has talent level 2 because I've never summoned for Bennett constellations because I don't want to build Bennett. I have him on a set and stuff right now because I was trying out stuff in Abyss for like rotation speed so I try to give him like a realistic looking set um, to see exactly the effects of C6 Raiden. I've been practicing that a lot, I've been getting better at it, so I'll be showcasing that um, in a later day. But that's essentially the team, then we have Kazuo, 1000 EM, then we have Zhongli who is his shield. So we're basically using Sara purely for her C6. So you have the C6 Sara that gives 60% extra crit damage to the Electro. Other than that, outside of that and delivering the Elegy for the end buff, as well as Forward Piece No Bless, which she will have in the video. That's all she's there for. Um, her E is obviously not doing much at level 4. Same with Ben if I were to use Ben at level 2, so I just didn't use them. Other than that, um, enjoy the one-shots with this one quick little artifact swap. I just don't like doing these types of videos normally because it's not realistic. I wouldn't use that crit damage circlet inside of Abyss because I want consistency. I like a little bit more crit rate than I do crit damage, just just how I am. Uh, but yeah, I wanted to show you guys the Strongest Riding Shogun with a bunch of buffs. I'm sure if I build up Sar and Bennett, I could easily break over a mil, 1.2 mil, something like that. I'm just not too into building them, um, they're not exactly my favorite units, and I only really go crazy on my favorite units, and I like to build units that are self-sufficient. Anyways, hopefully you guys enjoy the rest of the video. Solidify! Falling leaves, adorn my knights! No turning back! Pawn to oblivion! One with wind and cloud! Storm the front! Pawn to oblivion! Order guide you! Shines eternal. You too will experience this suck. I 